looks like a Chinese Jiangwei class cruiser with a North Korean destroyer escort. in the Yellow Sea took a turn for the worse today when North Korean and Chinese forces blockaded and boarded a Japanese cargo ship. The North Korean government released no official statement and their ambassador remained out of contact. While at the UN, Chinese ambassador Long Dan urged the US and her longtime Japanese allies to remain calm, calling the blockades a legitimate response to what the rest of Asia views as a possible remilitarization of Japan. This blockade is an act of war. The NSC is working on a formal response, and they've ordered the USS Walsh to close at flank speed. The Walsh is the most advanced spy ship in history. My best man will be on board. What do you know? Chinese and North Korean ships working together again. It's what we expected. That's a 056 prototype, Chinese. Exactly. How are your sea legs? I haven't lost them. Good. Because the 056 prototype isn't the only new fish in the pond. Admiral Toshiro Otomo, head of Japan's newly formed Information Self-Defense Force, had this to say. This is another distressing attempt by China and North Korea to further depress our faltering economy. The ISDF and Japan appeal to our allies for the military support promised us under the post-war constitution of 1900 and The fact remains that in the eyes of many in Asia, the ISDF itself is a violation of the post-war constitution prohibiting Japan from maintaining a military force capable of striking beyond its borders. In Asia, the memories of Imperial Japan are still fresh. Fisher, an American engineer named Bruce Morgan Holt has been kidnapped by a Peruvian separatist group called the People's Voice. Their suspected leader, Hugo Lacerda, is a hardcore revolutionary preaching information warfare as the only realistic means to achieve revolution in modern society. I you to get in there and recover or destroy any information Morgan Holt may have been forced to divulge, and if possible, rescue him. As for Lacerda, He's just been bumped onto our target of opportunity list. So if you have a shot, take it. Hostage rescue isn't normally our bag, but Morgan Holt was part of Project Watson, the UN committee that studied Philip Mass's handiwork after Georgia. Some people are worried that this kidnapping is just a cover-up and that Morgan Holt is being interrogated for classified information about the Mass colonels. Fact is that some of the tricks Mass came up with could be used to do a lot of damage. We need to contain that information at all costs. The target area is a lighthouse attached to an abandoned Spanish colonial-era fortification and some nearby structures. We don't have an exact location on Morganholt, so you'll have to find him yourself. Insertion will be at night by Zodiac onto the beach beneath the fort. Thermal imaging shows that there are some old natural and semi-natural caves under the fort, so you may be able to use those for infiltration. All right, Fisher. The helicopter will drop you a few kilometers offshore in the Zodiac. You'll have one of my Zodiacs and logistical support in and out of the target area. Extraction will be by helicopter from the top of the lighthouse.
This place, International, holds the contract with Wright Pritchard Technologies to protect their VIPs in potentially hostile situations. We did a thorough threat evaluation for their project in Peru, and we accepted the VIP detail on Morganhold. The guys who came after him knew what they were doing. This was not a tourist grab. I lost three good men in the snatch, and I'm currently preparing a rescue plan for approval from Morgan Holt's family and Wright Pritchard. This is going to cost this place a lot of money. Hearing gunfire down there, Fisher. Everything all right? It's coming from up ahead, but Lambert. When I think Gorilla, I think Kalashnikov. What do you mean? I've had enough AKs fired at me in my time to tell you that wasn't one. All right. See if there's anything unusual going on with their equipment. And keep us posted. Nice piece. Where'd you get it? Oh, God. I don't know. I really don't know. That's bad news for you, then. Ah, uh, I tell you if I knew. I swear, please don't kill me. Fine. If you don't know where the guns came from, then tell me something else that's useful. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Morgenholt. Morgenholt. You must be here for him. He's in the room just ahead. I think they're torturing him. Torturing him? <laughs> Thanks for the info. Mm, no, no problem. I think you're right about the equipment, Sam. Yeah? They got themselves a little stockpile of high-tech kit here. Try and find out where they got it. See if those crates have SSCC barcodes on them and scan them with your EEV. The SSCC code is lot one of five. See if you can find the other four. I'll do my best. I think I see something. Don't you think he's had enough? He's had enough when he can't talk. Talking? Madre de Dios, he hasn't been able to speak for an hour. He could be faking it. Jesus! See, I bet he's faking it. Faking it? His tongue is a lump of coal, his brain is... Enough! Saul, give him more. 
It's already at the maximum. What? Should I bring down another battery? <laughs> what do you say, amigo? You want another battery? <laughs> Wait a minute. His... Uh... His ears! Look! Smoke! I think I'm going to be ill. I think he's dead. <laughs> Only one way to be sure. Uh, I'm going for a walk. What the... What is that? Doesn't sound too good down there, Fisher. The sound isn't the problem. You should smell it. You're sure he's dead? Deader than Elvis. All right. Leave the body. We still need to recover any traces of the interrogation. Grim will call you back. Fisher, I said leave the body. We don't have the means to extract him. Just because he's dead doesn't mean I need to leave him here hanging like a piece of meat. Don't get too connected, Fisher. I need you to stay rational. You can spare 30 seconds for some simple dignity. Sam, it's Grimm. We need to make sure that whatever Morgan Holt might have told them about Mass's algorithms never leaves this site. Okay. I detected a wireless link coming from the technician who left the room before you entered. So I'll need to recover any data he might have uploaded to their servers. Exactly. From the looks of it, these gorillas have a pretty temporary setup. Seems unlikely they have any kind of alarm system on location. Good. Hi there. You look important. I am loyal. You will get no information from me. Really? Hmm, it looks like you forgot to shave this morning. Let me help you out a bit. Huh? You can't! Hey, what are you doing? Okay, okay. What do you want to know? I'm looking for Lacerda. He's been behaving very badly lately. Well, you're wasting your time, American. He left on a boat an hour ago. He could be anywhere by now. I guess I'll just have to follow him then. Don't worry, he won't slip away. I think that confirms it, Fisher. Yeah, seems like Lacerda is long gone. We'll see if we can track him through Echelon. Don't worry about him for now. We'll keep you posted. So, um, you remember that little chiquita from the bar last Friday? The one with the tight t-shirt? How could I forget? She called me. We're gonna go have dinner. 
We're gonna thank her for Riggs. Riggs? That's four of the five crates, Sam. Keep your eyes peeled for the last one. Did you hear footsteps? No. I didn't hear nothing. What sort of a guard are you? We're supposed to be paying attention. is the one that the tech transferred the interrogation record to. You'll need to access it. Good work, Sam. That wiped whatever information Morganhold might have given them. They wonder what happened to it? It was easy enough to make your little intrusion look like a memory allocation error. Don't worry, we give you the best tools. Evening start, Maria Narcisa. Come in. Evening start, Maria Narcisa. Come in. Damn, you just took out their radio operator. He asked for it. Well, it's going to be a lot harder to find out where they're smuggling their arms in from. You'd better check their radio logs. They probably keep a hard copy archived on file somewhere. Okay, I'll look around here. Maria Narcissa. You're not trying to set me up on another blind date, I hope. The Maria Narcissa is a boat. So was the last girl you set me up with. Fisher. Sorry. The Maria Narcissa is a cargo ship owned and operated by Celestinia Inc., Portuguese shipping company. 
registered in the Philippines, cross-Pacific freight contracts. Lots of details missing. Sounds suspicious. Sounds like I'm setting you up for another date after all. Can't wait to meet you. I saw something down wow. there. They say that we are at the right latitude. That's four of the five crates, Sam. Keep your eyes peeled for the last what one. What are you talking about? Madre de Dios. You live in here? The International Space Station. There's been an accident. They've lost radio contact, and they've confirmed that there's major damage. They expect that the debris shower sometime this evening. In pride. In reasoning pride, our error lies. All quit their sphere and rush into the skies. Him, the almighty power, hurled headlong and flaming from the ethereal sky, who does defy the omnipotent worm. Ay, ay, ay. And I thought I was a dilettante. Education is the difference between a revolutionary and a terrorist. Why did you torture Morgan Holt? La Celta! He wants algorithms! Some kind of computer algorithm! What does a second-rate communist revolutionary want with a computer algorithm? I don't know! I don't even think La Celta does! I think someone might have hired us! What makes you think that? I don't know! La Celta! He's been making lots of deals! Something's going on! I don't know what. But you don't know who he's been talking to. No! And you're not much good to me anymore. That server is the one that the tech transferred the interrogation record to. You'll need to access it. Good work, Sam. That wiped whatever information Morgan Holt might have given them. Don't they wonder what happened to it? It was easy enough to make your little intrusion look like a memory allocation error. Don't worry, we give you the best tools. Thunderstorms make me nervous. Why? I was a boy in Granada when the Americans invaded in 83. My father was in the army. When he realized we could not win, he led us into the mountains with some of his men and all of our families. And? The Americans caught up with us one night in the middle of a thunderstorm. I think I see something. <laughs> Open the gate. Well, now the gate is broken. I use the old gate. How am I supposed to get this place up and running with all this old crap? Who would put a gate here anyway? It's stupid. Pointless.
Evening start, Maria Narcisa. Come in. Evening start, Maria Narcisa. Come in. Maria Narcisa here. Cargo received, Maria Narcisa. It all checks out. Affirmative, Maria. Maria Narcissa. You're not trying to set me up on another blind date, I hope. The Maria Narcissa is a boat. So was the last girl you set me up with. Fisher. Sorry. The Maria Narcissa is a cargo ship owned and operated by Celestinia Inc., Portuguese shipping company. Registered in the Philippines, cross-Pacific freight contracts. Lots of details missing. Sounds suspicious. Sounds like I'm setting you up for another date after all. Can't wait to meet her. Fisher, your primary objectives are complete. I can extract you whenever you're ready. You'll need to signal for a helicopter pickup from the top of the lighthouse. Make sure the light is out first. Will do. Come on! The body of kidnapped American computer engineer Bruce Morgenholt was discovered in a village in Peru this morning. Implicated in the kidnapping and failed ransom attempt is Hugo Lacerda, alleged leader of the People's Voice, a newly formed guerrilla organization. Here we see the USS Clarence E. Walsh en route to the Yellow Sea for her first assignment amid rising tensions in the region. Dubbed the flagship of a 21st century fleet by Defense Secretary Mason, who reaffirmed America's commitment to our Japanese allies. It is our hope that the presence of the Walsh, now the world's premier electronic and information warfare platform, will help defuse the tensions in the region. Information you recovered in Peru makes it look like Hugo Lacerda was contracted by a third party to kidnap and interrogate Morgan Holt. His payment was in weapons. He appears to be using those arms to equip his own men and pay off debts to other guerrilla groups. Maybe Lacerda is a nickel anti loser, but maybe he's learned some things from Morgan Holt that we don't want anyone to know. Maria Narcissa is out to sea so there's no escape. Board her, search her, find out who Lacerda's been dealing with, and then make sure he doesn't have an opportunity to spread what he knows. Fifth Freedom. What Morgan Holt knew about the mass kernels, recursive computation, and weaponized algorithms is akin to what Oppenheimer knew about atoms or what Turing knew about digital computers. Project Watson, the United Nations investigation into the mass kernels, will be remembered for centuries alongside the Manhattan Project as fundamental research that changed the nature of warfare forever. Imagine if Che Guevara had kidnapped and interrogated Oppenheimer in 1959, and you have a pretty accurate parallel of the situation we're in right now. We're going to send the helicopter out about 40 clicks ahead of the Maria Narcissa and leave you in the water on her course. You'll board covertly onto the bow. Search the ship and the holds. Find out what you can about the arms shipments and who Lacerda is dealing with. Satellite imaging shows the Maria Narcissa racks a small launch on the stern. That will be your primary extraction. If things go badly, we might be able to arrange to pluck you out of the sea. We'll keep the Walsh inside a helicopter range of the target vessel at all times. If something goes wrong, we should be able to assist in extraction. If you play it safe, we'll recover you in the ship's launch from open water once you're out of visual range of the ship. Fisher, we just pulled up Celestinia's last dry dock report for the Maria Narcissa. They have a newly installed central alarm system. Don't tell me. Three alarms and the mission is over? Of course not. This is no video game, Fisher. But you don't want the whole place alerted to your presence. 
Keep it under control. Nice night. Shh. What's the roster? How many men aboard? Total? There is 36 of us, I think. But that's including Lacerda and a couple of mean looking mercenaries he brought with him. Where's Lacerda now? He was just here 20 minutes ago, complaining about his quarters. He said he wanted another room. Lacerda is probably drunk by now. <laughs> Fisher, it looks like Lacerda is spreading around his newfound wealth, paying off debts with some of the arms that were delivered to him. You want me to scan any more weapons crates? Better idea. Plant tracking devices on them, and we can see who they end up getting delivered to. Okay. Good job, Sam. That's the first crate. Keep your eyes peeled for any more. All right. Fisher, we just intercepted a radio call from the Maria Narcissa. She's reporting a hull leak and asking for an escort. The ship is sinking. No, but apparently several compartments are flooded. You'll need to activate the bilge in the forward machine room to access all the cargo holds. Noisy down here. Oh, my! Makes it easy to sneak up on people. What is this hold? The auxiliary pump is here. There are some flooded compartments. The pump should be able to drain them. Thanks for the information. Fisher, those compartments are flooded. 
You need to activate the emergency bilge pump to drain them. There should be a large pump in here that you can use to drain the forward cargo hold. I'll find it. You gonna start that pump there or what? I don't know how these stupid things work. Someone moving around out there? Who? Don't know who. That's why I'm worried. <laughs> Who's walking around out there? Good job. That'll drain the flooded compartments. Now you can search for the bill of lading attached to Lacerda shipments. All right. I'm betting that Lacerda's shipping container is somewhere in this compartment. The bill of lading should be mounted on the side. I'll have a look around. Work, Sam. It looks like whoever delivered <coughs> these arms to Lacerda was operating through a proxy. Who? Mercantil Costa Fuerta Seguridad de Panama. Offshore bankers? Yeah, the cigar chomping kind. Great. I love bureaucrats. You still need to recover the transit ledger so we can figure out who else Lacerda is dealing with. Try the ship's office. They should have that information. Information you recovered it. Fisher, we just pulled up Silistinia's last dry dock report for the Maria Narcissa. They have a newly installed central alarm system. Don't tell me. Three alarms and the mission is over? Of course not. This is no video game, Fisher. You don't want the whole place alerted to your presence. Keep it under control. That's their alarm system, Fisher. I'm warning you. Be Fisher, we just pulled up Silistinia's last dry dock report for the Maria Narcissa. They have a newly installed central alarm system. Don't tell me. Three alarms and the mission is over? Of course not. This is no video game, Fisher. But you don't want the whole place alerted to your presence. Keep it under control.
What are you doing up here? Fisher, it looks like Lacerda is spreading around his newfound wealth, paying off debts with some of the arms that were delivered to him. You want me to scan any more weapons crates? Better idea. Plant tracking devices on them, and we can see who they end up getting delivered to. Okay. Good job, Sam. That's the first crate. Keep your eyes peeled for any more. All right. Ooh. Fisher, we just intercepted a radio call from the Maria Narcissa. She's reporting a hull leak and asking for an escort. The ship is sinking. No, but apparently several compartments are flooded. You'll need to activate the bilge in the forward machine room to access all the cargo holds. There should be a large pump in here that you can use to drain the forward cargo hold. I'll find it. You want to start that pump there or what? Oh, oh, what's wrong with this thing now? Hey, spoken like a true technician. Cover! That's their alarm system, Fisher. I'm... That's their alarm system, Fisher. I'm warning you. Fisher, it looks like Lacerda is spreading around his newfound wealth, paying off debts with some of the arms that were delivered to him. You want me to scan any more weapons crates? Better idea. Plant tracking devices on them, and we can see who they end up getting delivered to. Okay. Good job, Sam. That's the first crate. Keep your eyes peeled for any more. All right. Fisher, we just intercepted a radio call from the Maria Narcissa. She's reporting a hull leak and asking for an escort. The ship is sinking. No, but apparently several compartments are flooded. You'll need to activate the bilge in the forward machine room to access all the cargo holds. There should be a large pump in here that you can use to drain the forward cargo hold. I'll find it. You gonna start that pump there or what? Good 
job. That'll drain the flooded compartments. Now you can search for the bill of lading attached to Lacerda's shipments. All right. I'm betting that Lacerda's shipping container is somewhere in this compartment. The bill of lading should be mounted on the side. I'll have a look around. Good work, Sam. It looks like whoever delivered these arms to Lacerda was operating through a proxy. Who? Mercantil Costa Fuerta Seguridad de Panama. Offshore bankers? Yeah, the cigar chomping kind. Great. I love bureaucrats. You still need to recover the transit ledger so we can figure out who else Lacerda is dealing with. Try the ship's office. They should have that information. Sensors in your suit are detecting a lot of fumes down there. Yeah, I can smell it. Some kind of gas leak. Could be enough to be a serious explosive hazard. We can't have any firing in the engine room. Wonderful. And don't expect the enemy to be smart enough to realize that. They might still open fire on you if they see you. I get the message. I'll be discreet. That's their alarm system. Sensors in your suit are detecting a lot of fumes down there. Yeah. I can smell it. Some kind of gas leak. Could be enough to be a serious explosive hazard. We can't have any firing in the engine room. Wonderful. And don't expect the enemy to be smart enough to realize that. They might still open fire on you if they see you. I get the message. I'll be discreet.
Sam, you're near the ship's office. This deck deck starboard side. I'll find my friends and the there. That's where they should be keeping them. Hey, hey. Did the Serda pass through here? here? Yeah, he was here a few minutes ago, ago complaining, complaining about, about letters. letters. Bastard. Bastard. I, hope I hope someone, someone got that trouble. Lazar, they're not a man to trifle with. I'm not, I'm not going, going to trifle, trifle with him. him. I'm hoping someone, someone else will do it. That someone would experience pain to the dead Lazar's hands. hands. Mm. Where is Lazar now? I don't, I don't know. know, and I don't want to know. Find the trans and the That's where they, they should keep keeping them. Imaginary Russian. Exactly. Now what do I want to go find out where they're there to hide? The captain probably knows where he is. Good idea. Why don't you want to get to bridge and ask? What was that? that? Uh, I guess it's not normal. Okay, Sam, judging by the numbering ring on the race, race that's that. Uh, uh, see if you can find the rat mask.
Good job, Good job Sam. Sam. Two more Two points, points to go. go. See me, Captain. Make your... What was that? I don't... See me, Captain. Make your heading 88 degrees, 6 minutes. Maintain speed. See, si, senor. Scopes are clear? See, si, senor. Gracias. I hear you have a special passenger tonight. What? Not? Oh, who? I'm the guy who's here to cash the checks lacerta has been writing. Where is he? That son of a... He was provoking my men, so I gave him my own cabin to shut him up. That's very kind of you. Be careful. He brought some personal bodyguards. They look dangerous. I'm not afraid of Lacerda's thugs. No, they're not Peruvian. They're Europeans, I think. Rose. Hmm. Thanks for the tip. The pleasure is all mine. So Lacerda is holed up in the captain's quarters. Where's that? Third deck, port side. The two interior stairwells are the only access to that deck. <laughs>
I tell you, never, never in my life have I been so insulted. I don't see why you're so upset. He got you past the inspection. You think it's easy to get through the canal zone with all the crackdowns these days? I don't care if it's hard. You think my job is easy? No. But this insult, forcing me to bribe an inspector out of my own pocket. No. This big shot, this vice president, Senor Segundo Ruiz de Medeiros. Ha! I'll show him. Fine. Mark my words. I'll make him pay. I'll make him pay double, or my name is not Hugo Lacerda. Great. I need another drink. Am I seeing things? Are you hearing Good things? job, Fisher. Did you hear that? I'll inform the joint case that the Santa is no longer a threat. Objectives are completed. We strapped you whenever you're ready. I love the smell of the ocean air. All I smell is burning off. I tell you, never, never in my life have I been so insulted. I don't see why you're so upset. He got you past the... This is bad, bad news. Good job, Fisher. I'll inform the Joint Chiefs that Lacerda is no longer a threat. Primary objectives are completed. We can extract you whenever you're ready. I love the smell of the ocean air. All I smell is burning oil and vomit.
With still no word from the North Korean government, China's Long Dan again urged all sides to come to the bargain. <laughs>